Oh, what's up, guys? Playing some more E Heroes. We're gonna deck thin here for a bit first. Um, we're gonna add um, this guy over here, Photon Thrasher, which I actually really like. Um, I think I'm, I'm playing two of him yet. Yeah, I'm playing two of him now. He's a pretty good card. I like him a lot. Um, we'll see if our effect is good on the Astratus. Yes. Okay, so it says yes. So we're gonna add the alias to our hand. And then uh, we'll duality. Let's add another duality. Because I don't think I need any more monsters. And we'll set bottomless. And then next turn, if I need to, I can go for an exceed. See what he's playing. Oh, so you're playing Gladiator Beast. Okay. Well, Bombus is pretty good against Gladiator Beast. Um, I think heroes have a, a pretty good matchup, I'd say, because all of them are 19 beaters. Um, it's, it's two Gladiator Beast. Okay. Oh, he, he's running double Red Yari. Sometimes I wish I ran two Red Yari, uh, just because. Um, you know, sometimes you draw Red Yari and like you really need to remove that turn. Uh, when you can't do it, it hurts a lot. And that's happened to me a few times. Uh, unless he's playing like Moray of Greed. But I mean, pretty much any Glad that he summons that can get over Stratos, I can just bottomless it and then that will hurt quite a bit for him. Let's see. So he's going to go for a Proving Ground. He's most likely, my guess, is going to go for Laquari. That's generally what they like to go for. And I don't blame them for that. That's a pretty good card. But still, again, Glass have the problem getting over, like, huge beaters. And everything in Heroes is at least 18... They, well, actually, no. Take it back. Ocean has 1,500, but... I pretty much just use Call Upon to use Ocean's Effect. Um, and Glads are really good like, with their War Chariot. And, uh, like, there's not too many effects that go on. Especially, like, this guy over here. He's just being special summoned. He's gonna go for, yeah, he's going to go for Laquari, and I'll bottomless Laquari, and I'll start beating him down just a little bit. I think I'll, summon, I'll probably end up summoning Alias. Let's see what he does. Summon Laquari. Oh, he's going to space second first. Okay. My poor bottomless. And then he'll have to have... Um, I'm just going to summon. Okay. Maybe I can... Uh, He's probably got like a lance or something like that down. Um, if I can activate this. Mirror Force is really good against Glads. <laughs> I like this card against Glads. And I really don't mind summoning this. Like, He wants to lance and then like bring the mill out. Mirror Force. Oh, okay. Pretty good. And he can't tag out. Take that. <laughs> I wonder what I said. <laughs> but, um. Now he's. I mean, I, I did go negative one, but I got that card for free, so it's not really like I went negative one. And like everything in my deck can run over his monster, so not too worried about. And I have to use Mirror Force, otherwise he'll probably best. Oh, okay, so he can he can do that. That's fine with me. That's not gonna really hurt me. And I will take one thousand. And my guess is he'll go for Bestiari. And that will destroy my back row. Best Jerry is the 1500 attacker, so pretty much whatever I summon can run over it. So I'll just probably special summon this and attempt to attack. Yeah, I'm just gonna go for Best Jerry. And that will. My poor Mirror Force will go away. Well, I mean, it was obvious that I had Mirror Force down. And it's just gonna end with Best Jerry by itself. And I do not agree with that. I feel like that probably wasn't the best play um, that he had. <laughs> So we are going to special summon that. Then, um, 
I can go for an ocean play right now. I feel, I feel like I'd rather just save the exceed for later on if I want to go for it. And we will attack. And I have stealth solemn judgment too, so. That's pretty good stuff. And then we can end right there. Uh, the problem with Glad's like, especially when you don't have back row. And he, used, he had a few spells though. I mean, um, I mean without that space typhoon, he would have got bomb list anyways. And, uh, I mean, he knew that I was a mirror force. I don't know, I kind of would have maybe saved the Lance from me attacking into him. I think that would be overall just more solid. At least I feel like it would be more solid. Um, I'm like really too afraid of a dark. I'm going to probably set Call of the Haunted though. Oh, he's dropping Gores. Okay. Well. I can go into, let's see what I want to do. I've already used Mirror Force. I can't, because I can't solve Judgment Gores. Hmm. Even Blade Armor's not strong enough. Because I don't want him to run over b my stuff. Um, so I go Heroic Champion Excalibur. That's something that I still have. Call. Oh, I want to make this, but like, War Chariot is just a problem. It's a problem card. <laughs> um, and can Utopia to stall for one attack? Yeah, we can do that. Uh, I can't normal summon up, so maybe he's two. Because I can go for Excalibur, but I feel like Utopia is just overall better. Uh, or did I take out Utopia? I think I might have taken out Utopia. Because I always ended up making this thing anyways, so... Yeah, that's okay. And that's 4,000 attacker now, so... He probably won't be able to get over that this turn. And uh, next turn I can uh, go for another one, and I can attack over his gores. <laughs> if I want to go for another one next turn, because I will have um, called Haunted to get back Ocean. I just hope he doesn't summon a Glad and sets War Chariot, because then I will be hurting just a little bit. All right, I just need a Miracle Fusion. I hope I get one of those soon. Okay. So we're gonna get back to this. And then we get to uh, net our advantage off Stratus. Oh, there's Miracle Fusion, what do you know? Speak of the best card, okay. Um, we get Ocean's Effect, we're gonna add back Stratos. Okay. And we can probably just game him right now. Um, we can like super game him, all right, let's go. to make a shining. We have so as for effects good. Like watch how dirty this is. Yeah, because he's already used gores, so I don't have to worry about anything. So we'll add one of these to our hand. Doesn't really matter um, what we're adding here. Because we can now overlay these two for Blade Armor Ninja. Unless he has like Battle Fader, I, I have games so hard, like, that's not even fair. We have the effect of Stratos again, because we totally didn't abuse it enough. Well, we have an Aedas, might as well add one of those. Um, and then I have Solemn Judgment, <laughs> so <laughs> I'm pretty sure I have game. I don't know if this would go away. I think since I overlaid with the card, it, it stays on the field. So. We're at uh, 29, and this is at 21, so we'll attack with uh, this. And so this one can attack twice, and that's game. Unless he has a battle fader again. 
Um, and I believe the one mistake he made was he attacked into me and activated Lance. He should have set the card. Uh, it would have been just much better for him. Plus, I feel like Eros already has a pretty good matchup against uh, Gladiator Beast. Uh, Gemini Spark is just an amazing card. And uh, let's see, what, what power cards did I have? I had well, Miracle Fusion, I guess, and Reborn. Okay, I had two. He had Gorge, which you can argue is a power card. Um, Mirror Force is actually a pretty good card against E-Heroes. I've noticed that now. Um, anytime when it makes zero, like even though it blows up their field, sometimes they won't have anything. Like Mirror Force can hurt heroes just a little bit, um, especially when you go for quick exceeds. But uh, I, I'm glad I, I, uh, I had two of these because um, I really do like two of these. I probably need to fix it, my extra deck. Um, Maybe I'll only run one zero, but I like zero. I like zero too much. Maybe I'll take a Cataster, but it's helped me a lot because I reborn people's uh, effect failures a lot. But uh, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Asian Eyes White Dragon, signing out.